still hot temperatures and we're halfway through October. Uh, yeah, it's not going to feel much like Halloween this weekend. We're seeing temperatures very much on the warm side. A nice look though this morning as we take a live look outside with our sky cam. We should be right around 91 degrees for an afternoon high. Well, big story out west is the cold weather. Colorado opened its first chair lift uh, in the mountains over there where they've been receiving some uh, at least decent snow, only one run open, but uh, kind of an early start by about a week or two for the folks there. But uh, winter is definitely on the way and some cooler air from the Rocky Mountains will be reaching us for the end to the weekend. Right now we're at 73 degrees, a little bit of cloud cover out there. The winds are mostly calm. Relative humidity is at 100%, so we are seeing some fog out there and there's a dense fog advisory in effect for our inland county areas. That's through 9 a.m. We also have that coastal flood advisory. Still a lot of hot, that water washing up on the beaches. That means our high tides are going to be continuing to run above normal. But as far as those visibilities down to zero in Beeville, the same for Orange Grove, Valfurious at about a zero as well. One mile in Alice, about four in Robstown, three in Kingsville. Temperatures are on the mild side, most in the 70s, but still 80 degrees right there. The Naval Air Station Rockport is at 78, 71 in Alice, 72 in Orange Grove. We have mostly calm winds at this point, and uh, we are seeing the fog. You can see that developing a couple of stray showers trying to come in off the Gulf one right there near Baffin Bay, but that didn't really develop. But we have this big area of high pressure is helping to pull that moisture on in from the south. These. So it's going to be hot. It's going to be humid for much of the weekend, but there is a little relief in sight. We've got a cold front that's going to be coming in and that'll be coming in tomorrow afternoon and that will be changing our weather pretty significantly. Now there is a chance of a stray shower across the area today and then you can see that front coming on in. Then that moisture is going to clear on out and we're going to see beautiful conditions with cooler temperatures and less humidity. That's what the beginning of the work week should look like. Now that front is triggering some showers and thunderstorms across parts of the upper Midwest and around the Great Lakes near Chicago this morning. Here is the center of that cooler air bringing the snow across parts of Idaho, Montana as well as Colorado. Temperatures pretty chilly there, 30 in Boise, 35 in Casper. That cooler air coming inching closer toward us, but not for today. It's going to be warm out there. Look for sunny, uh, isolated showers possible, a high temperature of 91 degrees tonight. Partly cloudy skies with some patchy fog. Look for an overnight low of 71 degrees. Seven day forecast. Well, tomorrow we will see some breezy conditions as that front comes through. Maybe an isolated shower fantastic weather with highs in the upper 70s and low 80s, overnight lows in the 50s and 60s. Then it'll gradually start to warm up a little bit as we get closer to next weekend. But a hot weekend, cooler air coming for the work week. Emily.